Hello everyone, Darth Snowby here. This is my follow-up video. I didn't intend to do it so soon, but I think there's those people who don't understand why do this do the theatrical cuts of the original trilogy mean so much to people? Why do they want it so much? Why are they obsessing over it? Well, I don't know about you. I would like to watch a film in the way it was originally intended. I don't want to hear this shit about George Lucas wanting to alter the movies to match what he or to match what he originally envisioned. No. No, no, no. The fans should have the ability to see the originals and the special editions if they want without spending ridiculous amounts of money just to see the, the unaltered versions or watch edits that splice up footage from various different versions of the movies just to watch the unaltered version. No, I do not want to watch the D special editions. I want to watch the movies as they were filmed. I don't want to watch footage spliced up from every version of the original trilogy that's existed. No, I want a legitimate release. Even if the quality may be passable to some people of the original trilogy on, on DVD, those are rare. Not to mention, they're not in that good quality. They're poorly transferred from Laserdisc. And I want a version that transfers the original trilogy, digitally remastered it, in HD. That's not a hard thing to ask for. So we can watch Han Solo kill Greedo, you know, him shooting first, so we can not see the horrible CGI job of the hut, or see some stupid shit that doesn't add anything to the movie. Or we can watch the ending for Return of the Jedi with the Ewok song instead of the song that, that plays in the special edition. Don't get me wrong, I prefer the special edition music over the Ewok one, but I want to be able to see it if I choose. The theatrical versions are the reason Star Wars exists in the first place. They're a big part of cinema. Without those versions, we wouldn't have anything Star Wars. And I think it's disrespectful to the fans not giving us what we want. I'm content with these, to be honest with you. However, if I want I want to upgrade Star Wars to Blu-ray, but I don't want to fucking some of the stuff they added to the Blu-ray versions. I don't want that. I don't want to fucking see a, another a fucking rock covering R2 or hearing that stupid screeching scream that Obi-Wan does in the Blu-rays or adding even more stupid shit in Return of the Jedi. Like Darth Vader saying, no! It wasn't, it was horrible in Revenge of the Sith. No one wants to hear that in fucking Return of the Jedi. That moment is far more powerful when Darth Vader doesn't speak. It shows you what he's going through without words. Why? Would you want to watch that version? I don't. I grew up with the special editions. I will admit that. But, to be honest, this is the most I'm willing to go in terms of how much the films have been altered. I'm not going anymore. No. There's no reason for me to upgrade. When the versions I have, they're in good quality. They may have some stupid edits, but nowhere near the amount the Blu-rays have. I don't want it. No. Give me the fucking theatrical versions. It matters to me and other fans because I want to see them in their own altered state in high definition. It's Star Wars 40th anniversary. What better way to give to celebrate it than releasing the theatrical cut of the original Star Wars, especially? I know 20th Century Fox has the rights to, to 
the original Star Wars. And I know George Lucas, for some reason, is holding... I, I want a clear answer. George Lucas, if you still have the rights to the original versions, give it to us. You're not losing anything. No one is. The only person that loses is the fans. I want to see the, the unaltered versions on Blu-ray. And many others do. I guarantee you, these would sell like crazy if you simply just fucking release them. Star Trek. The original series. I can watch the unaltered versions of the episodes. And the ones, the version with the enhanced effects. I have that option. I have a choice. You see, Lucasfilm, learn from Star Trek. Give us an option. It's not so hard. It's a win-win situation. You get money off of this, fans get what they want, everyone's happy. I'm still not seeing Rogue One or Episode 8 or any of the movies that follow, but I can at least... I can at least have those. I'm more willing to get the prequels on Blu-ray, but not the originals. Because I refuse to suffer through those fucking special edition changes. Just so I can watch it in 1080p. Fuck that. With 4K becoming prominent, this would be a great idea to remaster them in 4K as well. It would be great! You're sitting on money. What are you thinking? That's why it matters to me and many other fans. I want to see the movie as it originally intended. I don't want to freaking upgrade just so I can hear fucking Darth Vader yell no or have some stupid screeching sound and a new hope of God knows what other edits they made to the special editions. No. This is the most... I'm willing to go in terms of alterations. No more. It means something to me because the original trilogy is my childhood. It's the greatest trilogy of all time. It deserves to have the original versions released in high definition. If Star Trek can do it, so can Star Wars. It's a good time as any to do it. What are you waiting for? And for those of you who, who don't care, why are you watching this video? You never, you don't care about Star Wars enough to, then. I think it's bullshit that an entire generation doesn't know about the un unaltered versions. The only versions they know about are these. In special editions. That's the only version that many people have seen in my generation and the generation that came after mine. It's sad that my generation, for the most part, don't even know about anything but these. I wasn't old enough to see the unaltered versions of the original trilogy, unfortunately. Yes, they may re-release them in, like, multiple times, so I had a chance to see them, but I was such a little kid, and I'm not going to explain my family problems here, but I never had a chance. Or to see them in theaters. That's the thing that's bullshit. Lucasfilm, get your heads out of your asses. I don't care what you have to do. Give us the fucking theatrical versions. You could re-release the fucking special editions as much as you fucking want. You could give us overpriced Blu-rays for the special editions, re-release them with nothing new in them, but you cannot give us the theoretical cuts. You're only going to get my money. Other than new Legends material, you're only going to get my money for the theoretical versions of the original trilogy and the prequel trilogy, because I refuse to upgrade the original trilogy to Blu-ray with those special edition changes. Fuck you. This is Darth Zenobia. May the Force be with you. And for those of you who say I don't care, go fuck yourself.
the unaltered versions are the reason we have Star Wars. Signing off.